Riplav with startup reference. Riplav with a startup reference is used in applications where specific output is required when the power supply is first turned on and the controls are off. The plus sign indicates that the output 01 is preferred over O2. This can be accomplished by building the splitter slightly off center. That's why when the flip first receives the power supply, the wall attach and is preferred to O1 output. SRT flip flop set reset. In addition to all capabilities of a basic flip flop, a SRT flip flop can also switch by applying a signal to the trigger port. The figure, the letters S or stands for set reset, respectively. They perform a regular control signal similar to C1 and C2. The letter T stands for trigger. Whenever trigger signal is applied, it switches the output or or NOR gate. Here, O1 represents the OR output, O2 represents NOR output, OR. The pressure at one or any co combinations of the control ports. NOR pressure at None of the control ports. The control signal at any one or any combination of these ports will switch the device to the O1 output. With all control signals off, the device switch to O2 output. And and an AND gate. The operation of AND gate is similar to the NOR gate, except that NOR gate is used to determine when none of the control is present, whereas AND gate is used to determine when all control signals are present. Both C1 and C3 control signals must be present to get an output at the O1 port. The absence of either or both will result in a stable output, the O1 port. Exclusive OR gate. Any an exclu exclusive OR gate provides output only when C1 or C3 or C5, C7 is on. The exclusive OR gate is obtained by feeding the output of a interaction cavity into the control port of an OR gate. When control signal C1 or C3 is on, the jet interaction cavity produces an output at O2 port and both C1 and C3 control signals are on then their interaction causes them to vent to the atmosphere and hence there is no output at port 2. Programmable logic can do Programmable logic controller we can shortly say PLC Programmable logic controller can be defined as a digital electronic device that uses a programmable memory to store instruction and implement functions such as logic, sequencing, timing, counting, arithmetic in order to control the machine and processors. PLC versus computers. PLCs are ragged and designed to withstand vibration, temperature, humidity and noise whereas computers are not. The interfacing for input and output is inside the controller. In PLCs, programming can be done by using a simple logic and switching function, whereas computers present computers in not in the case. Elements of PLC Central Processing Unit Programmer and Monitor Input Output Signals The input from sensing devices, the input module transfer to central processing unit CPU from which it can uh, interact with programmable can monitor programmable programma, programmer or monitor PM from the CPU central processing unit it will transfer to the output model module from which the outputs to load the devices Central Processing Unit, the CPU controls the process or the operations with PLC. 
The CPU receives input data from various sensing devices such as switch, executes the stored program and delivers the corresponding output signals to various load control devices such as relay coils and solenoids. It consists of a microprocessor with a fixed memory and a variable memory, a ROM and a RAM. Programmer or programmer or monitor. The programmer or monitor it's a unit allows user to enter the desired program or into the RAM. The program which is entered in relay logic determines the sequence of operation of the symbols to be controlled. Input output module. This model interface between fluid power system input sensing and output load devices and the CPU. The purpose of input output module is to transform the various signals received from or sent to the fluid power interface device such as push button switches and pressure switches. So these are the PLC LADAR programs or logic functions and then logic or logic then logic and non logic other things from which we can generate a circuit as much what we require so we have the enough knowledge about this kind of gates and circuit we can generate and prepare a own circuit as per the as per the requirement thank you